You'll do it exactly as you did tonight, and that's an order. You mean you liked it? No, but the audience did. That's why I'm going to give you another number. And I'll choose a new song for you. Oh, thank you, Mr. Zigfeldio. The only thing is, though, uh, about that song, I mean, a song, you know, it's a very, very intimate thing. I mean, it's, it's really between me and the um, audience. <laughs> so? So, um, <clears throat> one of the things I really feel definite about is choosing my own. Choosing your own what? Song, songs. Good evening. And congratulations. Both of you. Oh, hello, Nick. It's you again, my first ruffled shirt. Good to see you, Nick. How are they running? Oh, head flow. Just like you and this little girl. First time I saw her, I had a hunch you two belong together. I have the same hunch. And it's aging me. Fast. I knew it. I was sure of it. It was you who told me I'm about me. I'm afraid not. I wish I, I had. I don't believe you. Have it your own way. And you had it your own way on that stage tonight, didn't you? Six curtain calls. Only five. <laughs> <laughs> but you stopped the show. I did? I did. I stopped the show. I stopped the Ziegfeld Folly. I knew you would. I wrote the card with your flowers before the curtain went up. What? The yellow roses. Oh, I didn't even have a chance to look. Oh. Oh, oh, they're beautiful. Dear Star, I, I told you so. Don't forget, I saw you work out. So where would you like to go? Blue Charles, Delmonico's, a party, two parties? I can't. I've got to meet a gang of people At in my At my world. mother's saloon. <laughs> Not again. Can't you skip it? No, uh, it wouldn't be nice. I mean, it's sort of a party um, for me. <sighs> you want to come? I'd love to. You mean it? Of course. Well, you, know, you better think it over. I mean, it's just a neighborhood thing. It might waste the whole evening for you. I'll be with you, won't I? Oh. Go ahead, get dressed. <laughs> 